Hello everyone, I'm Brian and today I'm going to be doing a trailer reaction to Voyagers, teaser trailer number one. So, I think that might be the right picture. <clears throat> and the, um, and the, uh, the, this, whenever I hovered over the, the trailer itself, it, it's looking like one way, I'm hoping it's another, although I did read a little bit about the, the, the description about this a little bit, until I got to a certain point, then I stopped. Because that's actually what I was hoping for with the red and what I was seeing was what I wasn't hoping for so other than that I don't know anything about this so let's go ahead and give it a shot it's from space which interests me so <clears throat> that's a profound thought we are both it's a lot of people they're children This is space, our future. Let's control. It's the blue. They're drugging us. What does it feel like to feel something? Blue. No, no, no. Drink it. What does it feel like? Increased pleasure. Hmm. I'll do anything you want. What is that over their head? It's like a headset? About the rules. We can do what we want. Yeah. Why are they all gone crazy? That's a profound thought. Okay. So, yeah, it was, I was thinking on along the lines, I guess. <sighs> it goes to human curiosity as well. So let's go over the trailer. <clears throat> so we, well, right, that's a teaser to the trailer. So this is the start of it right here. Oops. They get launched into space with a whole bunch of children and one adult. And this is says this is control, our future, and this is control, the blue. And then uh, I guess it's the fact that because of how they're raised, we start hearing them, it's the blue they're controlling us, so they start getting suspicious on their activities. Basically, why do we have to drink this? Why can't we get a choice to have, basically in this life they have almost no choice. They have to live a certain way. They're living a regiment that they have to do, you know, get up, do work, eat at this time, eat this food, eat this, or drink this drink. And it's all kind of the same. Um, what do you say? It's scheduled. <clears throat> but then, and you know, you're not supposed to think outside the box, but some of them start to think outside the box like why do we have to do this and this kind of affection I guess teenager <laughs> hormones and they start questioning a whole bunch of things and what it seems like is I wonder what happened there it seems like that kind of you start seeing a whole bunch of animals which is animal instinct Basically, humans are animals, and we have instinctual needs or instinctual acts, which we see right in front of us, hunger. We have the desire to eat, drink, shelter, and how do I put this? Uh, uh, grow our species, survive. Survive and survive. Eat, drink, shelter, survive, and survive pass on our genes basically and then without without I guess a I don't know how to describe this but it goes again it goes back to I guess a primitive instinct 
to alpha males and probably alpha females in this where you'll see a little bit later on here you know people start desiring people well alpha predator and a prey predator and prey should I say and we see fighting there going on basically showing who's the strongest alpha male <clears throat> and there's a lot of a lot of um what do you call it um even today we're still kind of like that we're we're still showing our basic instincts you know um female and male and i'm wondering if this is what's going to ex uh, explore uh, i guess our baser instincts i wonder who are these do they have to be there's only one adult here i'm, I'm thinking so basically this is the alpha male, I think, and I think what's happening here is that he's become not necessarily corrupt, but a dictator, which is not necessarily corrupt, it's just a dictator. A corrupt is official who has power that's being influenced by something else, I think. I guess he could be corrupt as well, but a dictator is already corrupt because he gets to, well, I guess, a corrupt dictator. How about that? <laughs> that's the better term for it. So they're trying to get him out because he's no one can no one can challenge his power and maybe there's a few people who will follow him so he has a lot of followers yeah. this is going to be interesting it's going to be uh, human psychology which is very honestly fascinating I, I i do find it interesting even though this is all stuff that we kind of know or well this is all stuff that we know and it's just curious as how the director or the writers the writers and directors portray it in a film as opposed to I think it's more fascinating to to watch real life <laughs> um, instinctual or real life events so dating game is one that's very fascinating so anyways um, based purely on this teaser trailer, I, I will give this a, a rating just because it, it feels like, at least for me, I, I, I understand it. And plus, reading the um, reading the um, the description of this trailer, I kind of understand what's going on. I'm gonna give this a four just because it falls along the lines of, in a sense, psychology to me and how we would act without, say, a centralized government or. Uh, mm, no one in power in a sense when i guess uh, what what they say is a, a, va a vacuum in power a power vacuum yeah power vacuum basically once the the uh, the children grow up to be teenagers slash adults and the the adult is old now where he can no longer contain the children where the children can fight back there will be an alpha male that will challenge his power and maybe even get rid of him if he doesn't submit to the alpha male's power and then he'll become a dictator something along those lines <laughs> all right what about you guys what would you write based purely on this teaser trailer alone would you give this a one i'm uh, sorry a five a must watch a four will watch a three may watch a two a may not watch or one won't watch i think i said i gave it a four let me know in the comments below explain your reason why if you like my content please consider subscribing thumbs up thumbs down down below thanks for watching i'll see you in the next vid